Okay, today is March 15th, the Ides of March. It's the 15th day of the Juice Fast. Uh, tonight I'm halfway through, and I just have to do it again, <laughs> this time with feeling. Well, I got up this morning, and um, I had a lot of stuff going on today, and I uh, thought I had like little places I had to be. When I first got up, I thought, man, I don't have time to juice, and I didn't have any orange juice done. And, well, I did have some juice in the refrigerator, but it wouldn't have been good, you know. So, but I, then I realized, oh, you do have time to juice. So then I juiced up a mess of orange and pineapple juice. And I had two eight-ounce glasses of orange pineapple juice, which was very good, plus coffee. And then uh, I did you know, one meeting. And then um, today was uh, a memorial lunch for a dear uh, spiritual advisor of mine, a a friend for many years, he passed away, maybe even, I'm going to say nine, ten years ago. And um, there's uh, two of us that get together once a year. His birthday is the Ides of March, March 15th, and we just celebrate him. He's really kind of a unique, wonderful individual. And uh, so, you know, my friend wanted to go to the India Cafe, which I truly love. And uh, first I thought, well, maybe for Tom, <laughs> I should have a meal, you know. And then I, and then I, I was kind of sitting with it. And this, I was already on the juice fast because she, we talked at the beginning, you know, the beginning of March, but I had already begun. And, and then after maybe 24 hours, I realized, maybe when I was meditating, I was reflecting on it, I realized, no, you can just go and have chai. And, and I did. I went and I had two glasses of chai. You know, which was very, and that's kind of off the diet because chai is kind of rich. It's a rich beverage, but still it's, it's a liquid. And to a certain extent, a juice fast, you know, you're in the big wide world of liquid diet, you know. So um, that was good. And, um, but when I was getting ready for the party, I thought perhaps I had hand made a, a dress. I had a Vogue pattern, really nice fabric. I, I really liked this dress that I sewed. And I don't know that I've ever worn it anywhere. And uh, after I made it, it was kind of snug, but it fit. And today I thought, I was feeling kind of light when I got up. And I thought, well, let me just try the dress on and see, you know, if I could wear it, you know, a nice dress to this uh, occasion. And that was like a moment of truth. It was like, I haven't gotten on the scale, but... <laughs> I'm about 20 pounds away from getting into that dress, and I could get into it like a year ago. Like, let's say, let's not even say a year ago, let's say like last June. And um, so that really gave me, you know, kind of brought me back to reality. It's like, okay, I know where I'm at here. So um, I, you know, came home after lunch. I did uh, some work, and then I went to the rec center. I did 12 minutes on the bike. I didn't get there early enough to do a lot of exercise, but I do do 12 minutes. I did a nice sauna. I went to meditate, and I've decided to. I need to get there. I know what time I need to get there, 3.30, and then I can do a, an exercise routine because I'm, I'm really um, mentally uh, very um, much in a place where I can, I can do that on a daily basis. And it's really nice to do the sauna before I meditate. I realize that... Um, yesterday. So I'm going to incorporate that and exercise. So I, I hit all those bases, but I would like to do a little more exercise. And um, when I got back tonight, I juiced up a mess of tomato juice, drank some of that. No, that wasn't it. No, I had tomato juice. I, I must have juiced up tomato juice in the afternoon. Yeah, I must have made up a bunch of tomato juice in the afternoon. I have it in the fridge still. And I had some. Then I went to exercise. Then I came home and I thought, you know, I don't want any tomato juice because I already had some. That's what happened. So I thought, you know, you need to make up a carrot juice. But then I thought, you need some greens. And all of the greens I had really was lettuce. So I got both juicers out. I have a greens juicer and a, you know, fruit, vegetable juicer. And so I, um, I juiced up lettuce. And then the other juicer, I did carrot, 
ginger strawberries. I finished off the strawberries and then I mixed it up. I had lemon, also some lemon. I mixed it up, but I had some kind of beet, fruity, carroty thing in the fridge. So I kind of mixed it up, but I, the, the lettuce taste was not good because I did two heads of lettuce. And, and I didn't think it would work, and it didn't. It was like too lettuce -y. But when I put the beet juice in there, it kind of masked it. So now I have lots of juice in the refrigerator. I hope I drank it. It's not really tasty. But um, so I did that. But then after I had some of that, I, I didn't drink a lot of it. Then I thought, you know, you need some bouillon. What you really need is some bouillon. So I made up some bouillon, but then I really made, I just ate too much bouillon and I had too many hard candies today. Today was kind of like, I feel like kind of stuffed. Like I, it was like, it was kind of a, I would call it sort of a fail. It wasn't a fail. I didn't eat anything. I walked into that Indian restaurant and man, I just, there's like few, few foods that like really get me where I live. And it's like, boy, a nice Indian buffet, you know, boy. But then quickly, I just thought, no, just get your chai. You'll be fine. And um, But my friend, it was supposed to be the three of us, and the guy forgot. The man forgot, Jeffrey. And uh, he called me later in the evening when he remembered. Because it's kind of an easy event to remember. Because it's always the 15th the Ides of March. Whenever you see that, it used to be tax day when I was growing up. And I think they changed it because of the ominous, you know, I'd say, beware of the Ides of March. And um, he called me and he was like so disappointed that he missed. But then he said, we decided that we're going to get together for another meal in honor of our friend. And we'll do it. I told him we have to wait till April so that I can eat. So now I'm looking forward to a nice Indian meal with my friends. So that's good. But it, it was just kind of like the, the bouillon and the candies. And it's like, eh, you know, mm. but I had my juice. And it is day 15, you know. It's I'm in the middle of it. I'm at sea. I'm like way out at sea. But it's not too bad, you know. Because maybe the bouillon and the candies keep me, you know, not getting too juicy. Like, I, I just don't like that too juicy feeling. Like, ugh, you know, too much juice. So anyway, so that's it. Um, it was a good day, but you know, I uh, I would like to uh, do pure juice because I'd lose more weight. <laughs> but my plan—it's another like basically four-month plan, you know. And by then, I think I will have lost at least 15 pounds, maybe 20, and then I'll be able to fit into that dress. And I hope. <laughs> It'll be a big day when I can fit into that dress. Um, you know, it's a goal, something to look forward to. So anyway, so I had my moment of truth trying to get into that dress, which just was not happening. And I was, I remembered why it is I needed to choose fast, even though I was feeling pretty good in my clothes and whatnot. But you know, I need to continue because I wanna, I wanna get to my ideal weight. It's like, you know. I, Life is an opportunity, and I think we should maximize it if we can. And for me, living in a comfortable body that I can, you know, get into stylish fashions and look good, it's important to me. So anyway, that's my wrap-up for day 16 of my 30-day juice fast, March 2022.